All right, all. It's another beautiful day at the Hugging Bear Inn and Shop. Look at our flowers are doing fantastic. I'm so happy with those. Um, and we had the sale going and we are still having a sale. So I did reorganize the shop so we could showcase some items that may have been overlooked in the last video and just put everybody out where they need to be so they can be seen and uh, find their special home with you. Um, so starting right off here in the Stife case with Dolly and the two Dicky Bears. I apologize, the sun's coming in there. The Bareback Rider. Some great deals on Stife. We're still going at 50% off Stife, which is amazing. Um, I did find the boxes to the band members here, and I realized we have four out of five band members, so there is a bear band member who we do not have, but if you have the bear band, now would be a great time to get his four uh, friends because they are 50% off. So it's like four for the price of two. It's pretty amazing. Uh, Roly Poly. The Fire Breathing Dragon. These guys with the painted on paws, they're pretty amazing. And the Little Tiny Stifes, we have three of those left. Um, the Twin and the Black Diamond Keychain, which is a beautiful piece. Um, some small finger puppets and whatnot right here on the counter, right next to the hand sanitizer, which we would appreciate everybody using as they enter the store. Uh, we're still wearing masks, but it seems to be comfortable. And we can just showcase a little bit. I was able to put some things in the proper case, so really give everybody the showcase they deserve. Lots of little random things that have been here at the Hugging Bear, and uh, maybe you're looking for a little memorabilia of Hugging Bear, and these are things maybe from the attic or that's a whistle. Um, this guy here with the binoculars, he's also a whistle. So cute. Little pewter figurines. Some little elephants I found. Just, just such cute stuff. Um, and then these little handmade little gem teddy bears. Artist bears of the tiniest kind. Some bear jewelry and a little picture frame there, a few ornaments, um, but some nice earrings, bear earrings, and koalas, and teddy bear necklaces, some small miniature pieces, the little wooden village from the attic, that's a very nice, interesting piece. Um, and I've moved the furniture, for the most part, all of the bare furniture that has been around the shop is now sort of showcased in this room by the office. So, um, some interesting things, some random items, but as well as just some very neat little whatnots that you may need or you didn't know you need until now. Um, the cockatoo marble pieces are really neat there. And baskets and little handmade furniture. Just some really beautiful places to show off your collection at home. Um, and, you know, little cases to carry things that can be a step stool or a small box. And then just some things I thought were kind of neat that have been floating around in the yard sale. And they are priced accordingly. So you can find some really neat treasures at very good prices right now at the Hugging Bear. So that's always, uh, that's always a good thing. I'm just going to shut the door. So we've got, uh, he's from Wyoming, that piece. The canceled stamps so we have moved all of the guns into this collection where they look a little bit squished but they don't mind they all wanted to be together so quite the collection of guns there um, Milo 
is this bear. I think he's often overlooked. He's a very beautiful grayish blue. Um, he, he's just a gorgeous bear. He's fluffy and fun and you know, these are great for kids. Graham, look at the face on Graham. How can you resist? Of course, Snuffles and Henry, uh, the superheroes. Ophelia, Penelope, we have a few left of our animated collection. Come on, let's monkey around. Let's monkey <laughs> around. One. Right up my alley, I can tell you that. Um, they're always looking to have fun around here. Peekaboo bears, again, these are the musical bear. Oh, Peekaboo is the most fun with you. Which is fun and this one has the sewn on eyes as opposed to the glass eyes. So a lot of the baby gunned items have the sewn on eyes so that there's no danger to any choking hazard. One Elmo left. Look at him. He's all by himself and that's a little oatmeal bear that I found. Um, hiding here in the shop but he is pretty awesome so of course our unicorn makes the gorgeous noise and the big lions toothpick fox so cute so let's take a look uh, we'll go over here to the stife the Christmas collections so some beautiful pieces the ornaments, Rudolph and Clarice, a couple ornaments there, um, and everything, you know, should have a box, and like I said, if I found any literature about any bears that we have, I've put their little literature next to them so you can read that if you have any questions. Um, up on the top, a club, the blue bear is a club bear, Christmas tree topper, uh, Birdie the Phantom Marionette, a couple of circus collections, uh, museum collection, apologies. And this one I really think is interesting. She's very pink, which is neat. So these are more club bears and event bears. Um, these event bears have their handmade piece uh, representing the hugging bear in. So that's pretty neat with their little cake. Um, so, ready for a celebration. And what I didn't realize until recently is that these have a squeaker. Um, sometimes they like to be quiet. Sometimes, of course, they're not going to squeak because I asked them to. So, but they do. <laughs> the Muffies and the Flannel and Gulliver's. Teddy Boo, I believe. Um, Teddy Boo B U, I think that's how you would say that. And Muffy, Muffy. Go in here. Now, I'm not in love with where the puppets are, but I'm getting used to it. Um, I think this room can sometimes feel a little cluttered, but at the same time, it feels like you're hunting for treasure, and that's always a good thing at the Hugging Bear. There are just some really cute puppets here, some things that you won't see anymore. I know that ostrich is no longer being made, so that really gives us, you know, some limited pieces that you won't find out there in the world. But they've been sitting here with their friends waiting for you. Look at that lucky dog. Could you be any happier? as a puppet? I don't think so. So again, just some interesting pieces and the poinsettias, they just keep on kicking. They love the hugging bear. Vander bears, Vander bears doing their things and um, some muffy clothes down there in the drawers. Also some uh, handmade pieces, handmade hats and whatnot, and then other things I've found around the shop, magazines, postcards, buttons, uh, paintings, 
all sorts of things, posters. So we have the dolls back over here. Those are porcelain dolls. They started at $150. They are on sale for $18. Some handmade linen pieces, a little pillowcase, some quilted things. Uh, this is our the Nis Nisbet Zodiac Bears collection of 12 of them. Uh, the boxes look rough, but they are a complete set, number 485 out of 1,000. Um, and the book is signed, so it's a pretty neat story. And their zodiac predictions tend to be right on. They said, I enjoy uh, fussing with things and hanging photos and um, arranging flowers rather than doing the scrubbing and actual cleaning. <laughs> Which if you know me, I do clean a lot but it's true. I would arrange flowers over scrubbing toilets any day. <laughs> so they had me pinned, that's for sure. Uh, the Lone Star Bears, like in the children's collection, and we even have a poster signed by the artist. So um, those are just adorable sweet bears from a book, the Lone Star book um, blocks. And then, of course, all of the random little outfits and clothing and hats and skis and golf clubs. Laura's Attic. Many of those pieces on sale for $2, $4. Um, some Douglas purses and some Douglas uh, blankie, binky blankies, I think they're called. Poodle ornament. So just some neat things here. A couple of beanie babies. Just a couple left. Those are big uh, hot items back in their day. So, and Muffy. Muffy, 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 Muffy. So lots of Muffy still here. Uh, Ron Lee, that's an applause doll. Pretty neat. I forget what her name is, but she has a funny name. Um, that's a little circus train made out of wood. It's very cute. Muffy's little activity places, the tent, the garden, gazebo, and more Muffy's. Of course, the puppets from the attic, they are here. They've been selling here and there. We did lose Mortimer um, and Charlie McCarthy, but the rest are still here those rakes bears, some artist collection, uh, bear hoppy in the Barbie Jeep. And here are some merry thoughts. So we put all the merry thoughts together. I've been calling this the Admiral Bear for two years, but come to find out his name is Nelson. And it's nice to meet you, Nelson. Finally know your name the bear with the bear purse and these little merry thoughts um i'd say they're about six inches so they are just adorable a couple of cradles we do have here and um they didn't make it into the furniture room just some handmade wall hangings and things so and priced accordingly four dollars nine dollars you know so like i said there are treasures in the back room and you are welcome to find them um so we've moved the disney's over here to the end all the poos and dewberry hi happy boy uh some of the gunned limited edition anniversary bears canterbury bears um those are gunned artist collection and now we have move oh here is a poo blanket that i found in storage classic poo um, throw for the couch all of the artist bears have come out here into the main room and those are the handmaids a lot of these are assigned numbered limited editions so beautiful beautiful things that's a douglas horse on the shelf there next to that little cowboy 
the Harmon Bears. I hope I'm saying that right. Um, they are just very distinguished looking. They're stern faces, but they're actually very hefty and uh, they feel good when you're holding them. So that's some, some very neat things in the Artist Bear collection. Um, Stif, we've got the animals out on the shelf. The little horse, Robbie Seal. These are some growlers, great growler bears. Um, those guys, I believe they are 1996. Uh, the one in the red sweater, he's just got, what a look on that face. Wutzel, <laughs> Wutzel. He's a very fluffy, soft, squishy stife. He's the only soft, squishy stife I've ever seen around here. Um, so lots of pretty mohair things. Those are Russ Wedding Bears from the 90s. And moving into the case. So remember we have all the white tags in the case for the most part. For uh, just keeping them safe. Admiral Penguin, Snow Weasel, Molly Hound, uh, Duffel Bear, Picnic Bear, Johnny and Jocko, Jewels, the Spring and the summer bears, the Ziadro, uh, the angel with the very delicate wings. She also comes with a bell. Yadro with the saxophone. He's a wind-up bear that plays the Pink Panther theme song. Really cool. These guys are also musical bears. The two there in the back, you squeeze them and they make music. Um, Picnic Bear, he's a club bear. There's a musical guy in the back there. He's a 1951 music teddy reproduction. The dancing bears and Splash with his little lamp post. Disney collection. Um, I found Richard in another area of the store that he wanted to sit with his Disney friends. And we've got the Stife. That Tigger, I believe, is number 58 or 56, so he's a real low number. We have two rabbits available, one piglet. I've also been able to move the Arjon Wright into this case, so we can showcase that. Um, Arjon Wright is 50% off as well right now. Unheard of. So just amazing pieces, including the chair, which would not normally be available, as that was sold with a Pooh Bear. The Pooh went missing, so we have the chair available. So that might be nice to add to a collection. And Louise. She used to sit by Louis, who was a dark Bordeaux colored club bear, but he has been sold. So Louise is now here with the ladies, and they are enjoying themselves. Compass Rose, and a little barley bear. These white bears are just so cute. The purple lavender. These are two growlers with just very distinct, beautiful faces. Oh, who's waving in the back? Paul. Hi, Paul. <laughs> He's so cute. And then in the main case, the shepherd and the golly and the uh, muzzle bear, that bear in the back there, he's a nice heavy weight, um, 1951 replica, he's a growler, uh, that jubilee bear with the blue, dark blue bow, so soft, that mohair is just very curly and soft, this red bear is very handsome, it's a red alpaca with a little collar on, and the dark blue um, bear, we have two of those available. The Postmaster, Charlestown, she's a beautiful bear. She's a wind-up musical bear. Margaret Stife with the uh, pendant, and she also comes with a book. Ava with the butterfly. Barley and Otto, that's a violet-tipped. Um, this one there is a violet-tipped bear. Huck Finn, 
I love the face on this little brown one. He has just got an incredible face. Um, Choco, I believe is his name, Hollywood. I don't know if you can see, but he has a little white chest hair. Very handsome. And Passport Bear, just absolutely adorable. Inside this little suitcase is a pair of boxer shorts and a small white t-shirt. I did not know that. I've been here for two years. I've never tried to open that case, and I did. And see, he's not real happy that I looked in his suitcase. No. But the clothes are so cute, I could not resist my... <laughs> yes. So I think, um, I think we got everybody. And I can't wait to see you guys. So if I can help you add any of these to your collection or just uh, you want to talk teddy bears, then uh, I'm happy to do that. Send me an email, shoot me a text, give me a call. And uh, yeah, I love, I love being here in the shop. And for all of you who can't be with us right now, enjoy the video. I will see you soon. Bye-bye.